Welcome back to another video. Today, the brand new T90 tank has been added to the game along with a few other changes such as helicopter skins and a new JLTV Game Pass update. The T90 is a 2 speed, 3 health, and 2 firepower. It is a 125mm cannon, 2 machine guns, and then a brand new passive laser missile disruptor. It's unlocked by completing Operation Tank Slayer, which is to destroy 45 enemy tanks with a tank. The way the disruptor works is any javelin that is shot towards the two red lights on the front of the tank will get deflected. However, the missiles only get deflected if you're looking at them when they're fired at you. This overall makes the tank almost immune from javelins, which will definitely make it much more difficult to destroy. There's also a free UGC that the first 15,000 people get that unlock the tank. The UGC is a T90 plushie and looks pretty cool. Skins are finally here for helicopters. They're the same for every other vehicle, but it does look good. Here are some of the examples of what the skins look like on the helicopters. Personally, I prefer the Special Forces Black skin, as I think that one looks the best. The JLTV Game Pass has gone under some serious changes. It is now equipped with one regular explosive machine gun and an additional 25mm machine gun. It also has two lock-on javelins, similar to what the Abrams X has. However, with this change, the JLTV has been raised from 49 Robux to 199 Robux. Anyways, do me a favor and check if you're subscribed since 87.1% of my views aren't even subscribed, so please do so as it's free and it helps me out a lot.